Hello YouTubers, Alaska Prepper here. It is currently 12 11 a.m. on the 23rd of June, which is very early Wednesday morning, and I'm surprised that I'm still awake. I wanted to show you all what it looks like in Alaska during the summertime at midnight. I remember that modern refugee was asking me how much sunlight we get, and as you can see. We definitely don't need any headlights to drive if we wanted to drive in these conditions. There's karma over there. As you can see, the sun has already settled over there. And the funny thing is, is that in the morning, around five or six, it'll come out right through here. And it'll be right overhead for most of the day. So this is what it looks like during the day. Now that we are out here, Oh, there's my uh, there's my tactical bug out SHTF vehicle, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Believe it or not, this little thing will hold me, and it goes about 25 miles an hour. Very nice little thing. Oh, look at that! My neighbor's coming down the road over here. <laughs> there's dog. Let's say hi to our neighbor. And, uh, yeah, like I said, this little thing is a lot of fun. Got it about a year and a half ago. Little Miss Alaska Prepper will get on this thing, and she will spend hours uh, going up and down our road. But let's go ahead and take a look at our potatoes, okay? Just a second. Let me call the pups. Karma, come on. Oh, just a second. Let me say hi to my neighbor. Karma, say hello. No. Well, she's watching my neighbor walk back to his car. So here's our structure, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said, if you saw my video that I posted earlier, you'll see that this is where we left off. And I'm coming back to check out this form right here. And look at that. Everything looks pretty good. So in about another 12 hours or so, 12, 14 hours or so, I'll go ahead and take that form off. But everything's looking pretty good over here. Let's go and uh, check out our potatoes. Now that we're out here, not too much other stuff to look at. And I'll tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, this little pile <laughs> of wood has been a godsend because I've used some of this already as some scrap that I needed to use. Very nice. <laughs> Very happy that I kept this. So here's our potatoes are looking really nice. Look at that. And I haven't had to water them for a while because it's been raining pretty good. I've had a couple that never made it up. I'm not too worried about those. I'm just going to reuse those probably for my cabbage that I still have to put out here. But everything else is looking really good. Hey, let me know in the comments if I should continue filling these up to the top with dirt. Let me know if I should fill the rest of these up with dirt. You see how I still have about two or three inches left? From the top of the soil to the top of the grow bags so let me know what you think but they're looking very nice let's go ahead and take a look at my other ones over here i want to show you the ones that our patreons told me to plant because if you remember patreons when we had our live stream i showed you some potatoes that i bought at the store and they were all you know they had a whole bunch of eyes sticking out of them and that was these look at these these were the ones that i bought at the store these weren't seed potatoes these were meant to be eaten and i just happened to leave them in my pantry too long before i ate them and this is what they look like and that this one's also one of them now these right here are seed potatoes it seems like the ones that were store-bought that were meant to be eaten are doing better than the actual seed potato ones See that? And believe it or not, ladies and gentlemen, I have one more, one more row of potatoes to show you. And that is right here. Look at that. And it looks like I have a couple here that didn't start either. Which, like I said, I don't mind. I probably have about four or five bags altogether that no life is coming out of them although i see a very very small one right there but i don't think those are going to make it 
And here you go. Here's another one. So I think I have about five grow bags that are probably going to get repurposed for cabbage and some of my other starters. And I'll be doing that uh, no later than the end of this week. There's Miss Kitty Cat <laughs> looking for field mice. And that's about it, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said, I just wanted to do this quick video to show you all what it looks like at midnight in the middle of summer in Alaska. And it's like I told you all during the live stream that it's like daylight all day long. Except that the sun is a lot more intense during the, during the daytime. During the daytime all right, hours. Having said that, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for joining in. I hope you got a little something out of this, if not some entertainment. And look at that. There's the family. I see dog over there. I see kitty cat over there. Dog and karma. <laughs> All right. Have a great day, ladies and gentlemen. Remember to be good to each other. When good people do good things, good things happen. Remember to reach one, teach one, and repeat. If we all did this, the world would be a better place. And you know that it will be a better place. Many blessings to all of you and your families. This is Alaska Prepper. And I'm out. Karma, say bye. Karma, say bye. Okay. <laughs>